That terrifying shark attack at a popular Southern California beach, the survivor of the vicious attack is speaking out this morning and he's getting very emotional about, uh, emotional about his brush with death and the jaws of a great white. ABC's Nick Watt has his story. Hey, get out of the water! Get out shark. of the water! This is the moment when Steve Robles' morning swim turned into a nightmare. Shark attack on a busy beach, July 4th weekend. You saw it coming at you. It made a real fast, sharp left turn and a lunge right up my chest. Look closely, it's hard to see. Apparently that right there is the shark's head moving up and down twice. You can just hear everything crunch. Listen and you'll hear his cries of agony coming from the water. And people on land realizing what just happened. Oh, sh you got bit. bit. Those, the horrifying wounds it left behind. The shark, a seven or eight foot juvenile, was mad. He'd been hooked by a fisherman on the pier when Steve, a long distance swimmer, got in the way. I felt the shark just gnawing into my chest with the whole body of the shark vibrating. I grabbed its nose with this hand and tried to pry it off of my chest. I was staring at this shark eyeball to eyeball, literally like right here. It was the most frightening thing I ever, anyone could ever experience. He punched the shark in the nose. It bit once more and disappeared. What does go through your mind? I didn't want to die. I, I just, you know, I, I was scared. I was, I was panicked and... Casey Fenwick was surfing just a few feet from the attack. There was just blood everywhere. The great white population in American waters is up 42% since 1997. Last week, a 12-footer was spotted off Cape Cod. And here at Manhattan Beach, juveniles are spotted nearly every day this summer by audacious paddle boarders. But this is the first time one has attacked here ever. I had a second chance, that's all I can say. For Good Morning America, Nick Watt, ABC News, Manhattan Beach, California. Thank goodness mm. Steve have, must have a mean yeah. left hook. Punched him in the nose. Yeah. And he said that today is the first day of the rest of his life. It's a new beginning. So blessed to be okay.